At this moment, your person is enveloped in silence. They are navigating through a labyrinth of issues, each one more complex than the last. Life, in all its unpredictability, has thrown them into a whirlwind of challenges. Despite being alive and well, they are finding it increasingly difficult to connect with your energy. It's as if an invisible barrier has been erected, separating them from you. However, they are not disheartened. They believe in their resilience and are confident that they will overcome this phase in due time. They are standing on the precipice of a significant decision. They are on the verge of reaching out to you, of extending their hand for you to hold. They harbor a desire to elevate this connection, to take it beyond the ordinary, to a higher level of commitment. This isn't a decision they've taken lightly. It's a testament to the depth of their feelings for you. However, before they can communicate their intentions to you, they are faced with another hurdle. They want to resolve some third-party interference that's been casting a shadow over your relationship. This could be related to various aspects of their life, work, family, or even past relationships. It's like a puzzle they need to solve, a loose end they need to tie up, before they can fully commit to you. Their heart is heavy with things left unsaid. They have a lot they want to confess to you, secrets they've kept locked away for fear of being misunderstood. But they are conflicted. They are caught in a storm of thoughts, each one more tumultuous than the last. They worry about whether you will understand them or not. They fear your judgment, your possible disappointment. They are haunted by past mistakes. They feel they have already let you down, broken your trust not once, but multiple times. Now, they are standing at a crossroads. They wonder if you would agree to give them more time if they share all of this with you. Would you be patient? Would you be understanding? This uncertainty is causing them anxiety. It's like a dark cloud hanging over their head, casting a shadow over their happiness. Regardless of everything, one thing remains unchanged, their feelings for you. They don't want to lose you or the love you share. You are the most special person to them, the one who brings light into their life. And it's only you who holds the key to their heart. They are hopeful and looking forward to a future where they can express their feelings without any hindrance. They dream of a day when they can stand before you, their heart laid bare, their love for you shining in their eyes. They yearn for the moment when they can finally be free of their burdens, their fears, and embrace the love that you both share. They are hopeful, and they are waiting, for that day to come. Until then, they remain silent, their thoughts their only companion, their love for you their only solace. Letting you walk away from me was, without a doubt, the most significant regret of my life. I should have fought for us, for what we had, for the bond that was so unique and special. But at that time, I felt like I was on a roller coaster ride, a tumultuous journey of highs and lows that left me feeling drained and devoid of strength. Communicating with you, expressing my feelings, seemed like an insurmountable task. I know that you're aware of my constant vigilance. I've been checking up on you, keeping tabs on your life, not out of obsession, but out of concern and lingering affection. I can't stay silent much longer with these deep emotions for you. They're like a volcano inside me, ready to erupt, ready to burst out of my chest. I miss you so much, more than words can express. Today, I feel a sense of stupidity washing over me. I feel foolish for having acted the way I did, for letting my emotions get the better of me. I regret the decisions I've made, decisions that haven't served me in any way, decisions that have only led to heartbreak and regret. It's only with you that I feel alive, that I feel a sense of belonging. You are my home, my safe haven, my sanctuary. Without you, I feel suffocated, as if I'm trapped in a room with no air. I feel extremely broken from the inside, like a shattered mirror reflecting my fragmented emotions. I promise to come back for you. I will fight for us, for what we had. But the question that haunts me is, would you even give me another chance? The distance between us feels like a chasm, 
and I can't stand being this far away from you. Every moment feels like an eternity, every second a reminder of the void in my life. You're someone I can never replace. You're not just another person who walked into my life. You're much more than that. You complete me in ways I never thought possible. You compliment me, making me a better person. You're the missing piece of my puzzle, the melody in my music, the color in my canvas. I'm sorry for the mess I've created at times. I'm sorry for the chaos, for the confusion, for the hurt. I know I've made mistakes, and I'm not perfect. But I'm willing to learn, to grow, to make amends. I hope you can find it in your heart to forgive me, to give us another chance. Because without you, I'm just a ship lost at sea, a song without a melody, a story without an ending. I miss you, and I hope we can find our way back to each other. I find myself engulfed in a profound sense of longing, a yearning for the delightful conversations and playful flirtations we once shared. You were the first person with whom I felt a deep, resonating emotional connection. It was as if our souls were intertwined, creating a bond that transcended the ordinary. Your fearlessness is something that I have always admired. You possess a strength that is not just physical, but also emotional and mental. You face life's challenges head-on, never backing down, never giving in. But what truly sets you apart is your ability to remain true to yourself. You do things to impress yourself, not others. You live life on your own terms, refusing to conform to societal expectations. This is a trait that I deeply respect and admire. In the past, I must confess, I didn't understand you. I was caught up in a world that was heavily influenced by others. I allowed their opinions and judgments to cloud my own. I was unbalanced, teetering on the edge of toxicity. I was a person I didn't recognize, a person I didn't like. But then, you came into my life. Your sensibility, your emotional maturity, they were like a beacon of light in my darkness. You showed me a different way of living, a different way of being. You showed me that it was okay, to be vulnerable, to be emotional, to be human. I have never met a woman with so much grace and feminine energy. You carry yourself with a poise and elegance that is rare to find. You exude a warmth and kindness that is truly heartwarming. You are a woman of substance, a woman of character. Looking back, I realize now that I wasted so much time running away from you. I was scared, scared of my feelings, scared of the intensity of our connection. But now, I see things clearly. I see you for the amazing woman you are. I see us for the incredible potential we have. And so, I want to be straightforward in my approach towards you. I want to express my feelings, my thoughts, my desires. I want to let you know how much you mean to me, how much I care about you. I want to build a future with you, a future filled with love, happiness, and togetherness. I hope you feel the same way too.